Hello and welcome to Royal Vibes. Prince Harry issued stark warning of a new book as bombshell revelations to undermine deal. Royal commentator Neil Gardner told Express.co.uk there is far less public appetite for books from the Duke and Duchess of Sussex in the wake of Queen Elizabeth II's death. So guys, as we get right into the full story, please do ensure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Turn on the post bell notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Consider liking the video and please watch it right up to the very end. Prince Harry has been issued a stark warning over his upcoming memoir with a commentator saying that any further attacks on the royal family would significantly undermine his own standing. Royal commentator Neil Gardner told Express.co.uk that there is far less public appetite for books from the Duke and Duchess of Sussex in the wake of Queen's death. He said any attacks on the royal family would be seen as being very poor taste. Prince Harry's book was expected to be released in the autumn of 2022, but there is speculation that it may be postponed to 2023. According to publisher Penguin, Harry's memoir will share for the very first time the definitive account of the experiences, adventures, losses, and life lessons that have helped shape him. Announcing the book, the Duke of Sussex said, I'm writing this not as the prince I was born, but as the man I have become. I've worn many hats over the years, both literally and figuratively, and my hope is that in telling my story, the highs and the lows, the mistakes, the lessons learned, I can help show that no matter where we come from, we can have more in common than we think. He said he is keen to share the first accurate and wholly truthful account of his own life. Previously, royal expert Richard Fitzwilliams warned that the revelations in the book might be a problem for Harry, you know, with his relationship with Prince William. Speaking on 34 Daily Podcast, this, he said, Both brothers are inseparable. And there is no doubt that one of the you know tragedies is that they have taken very, very different roads. And I see no, no risk being healed, unfortunately, because what you are looking at now is a memoir that Harry is writing that is coming out in the autumn. The problem is what is going to be in that book. It's very difficult after Oprah Winfrey interview, which is just a year ago. And I thought it was so destructive and also open to different interpretations. But speaking to Express.co.uk, Mr. Gardner said, I think that there is far less public appetite for books by Harry and Meghan and I think that if Harry's book contains any significant attacks on the royal family, I think there will be a strong backlash. Certainly, it will um, significantly you know, undermine his own standing, especially in the UK. I think that there is far less appetite for attacks on the royal family. They would be viewed as being very poor test. The country was in a period of national mourning until Tuesday following Queen Elizabeth's death. The former monarch's death was announced on September 8, 2022. Her funeral took place on Monday at Westminster Abbey and was conducted by the very reverend Dr. David Hoyle, Dean of Westminster. Around 28 million people turned in to watch that service, which was broadcasted for over 50 UK channels. You know, the government said that more than 250,000 people visited Queen Elizabeth II as her coven was lying in state. So guys, what do you make of that? Make sure you leave your thoughts down in the comment section below. With that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.